Hey everyone, welcome back. So, my last stream, the audio wasn't looking right. I don't know why. I don't know why, what was going on. So I decided I'm going to change games because it's just best we play a different game. So, we're checking out this game called Long Days Gone. Long, oh, Long Gone Days. I don't, can't speak tonight, but Long Gone Days. This is a game that I found on Ishtar.io, but it's also available on Steam, which I'll have the, the, um, the thing in the comments, the, this, yeah. Long gone days. Oh, let's see this, this, this. I'll have it the uh, posted. So if you want to check it out for yourself, I post it into the um, comments section, the chat section. So if you wish to check out yourself, basically what this game is about is we we open this up. Basically, is you follow Rook, a long man chained from birth to be a sniper for the core, a subterranean for the military state. On his first mission, he is sent on the surface under orders of great significance. Motivated to finally be able to show the fruits of his chain, he carries out his first orders in, to perfection, only to find out that the core was far from being the noble organization he thought he knew. So, this is a game. Which is pretty much your sniper, I'm pretty sure. The content may not be appropriate for younger kids, so just view your description as advised. Let's just jump into it. See what happens. I'll turn the volume up a tiny bit. Let's just jump into this game. Enough of me talking. Let's just see what happens. Common knowledge. What is common knowledge? From the day I was born, I, it was decided that I'd be a sniper. As soon as I could talk and understand orders, my training started. It was the same for every single one of my brothers, or so I thought. Because of this, I grew up believing that the things that were taught to me at the Corps Army were things everyone knew about. But who gets to decide what is important to know? As I was growing up, knowing anything about things like history or even how a family use, usually a function seemed like a complete waste of time. Meanwhile, learning how to control my breath and how to move my fingers accurately were far more important. When you have spoon fed, when you have been spoon fed with limited choices your whole life, you don't really question the stuff given to you. You just assume it's normal. But what use are those things that I have taught was taught during the past 22 years if I was ever taken away from the battlefield? If it wasn't for the events in the past few days, I would have never questioned any of those things. Rook, everything has been set up downstairs. They should be arriving soon. I'll go to my position. Hey. Hmm? We're all counting on you. Thanks. We should be the ones thanking you. I'll make sure to stop any shorter who comes near the tower. Good luck. Stop them. I can't even stop myself from doing this again. Oh, 
Rook. They are here. I see four, four drones over here. Take them down as fast as you can. You have limited ammo for your rifle. Make good use of it or we'll have to retreat. Move around using the arrow keys on your keyboard and push X to shoot. Okay. All right. Um, this last one. There's one more. There's the last one I have to shoot. There is. There are no more drones left. Just in time. They should be making an entry real soon. Stay focused. Rook. They know we're here. They'll try to break in. Take those shoulders down before they do. Um, there's one more soldier around here somewhere. Where is he? There he is. Oops. There we go. Hold on, Rook. That should be enough. What? No way. How did they get here? Rook, come downstairs. Quickly. What's up? What's going on? I'm coming. Uh oh. How many more are hiding here? Huh? Rook. Let's go. You won't get rid of us that easily. I hope you don't have issues fine, of course, Rook. I can manage. Most enemies have multiple spots you can aim at, and every spot has different stats. These stats can be seen during target selection. Aiming at certain body parts can give you advantage in battle. Some are harder to aim, but can deal more damage, while others may be easier to shoot, but have higher defense. Okay, let's attack. Um, attack this person. Um, attack your head. Okay, uh, attack. Attack you once again. Attack you. Okay. Uh, so we do have skills, but Rook delivers a quick and powerful shot at the center of the massive point. Requires eight skill points. Okay, we're not doing skill points. So. We're going to keep doing this. Okay, let's do... This person... Head. He baited. Attack. This person. Uh... Body. Okay, he's dead. Okay, she Let's attack her head. Attack her body. And she's dead too. Rook, we need to leave this place now. I was going, come on. 
You coming? Uh oh. Was surprised to find you here. Hey, tell the lieutenant we found them. I knew there was something real going on here. Don't take this personal. I don't want to do this either. Day one, Service Academy, inside the core. All right, let's continue. The first thing you should remember when you cross the border is that you'll be within Russian territories, even though it's separated from the mainland. No worry, we teach you a thing or two about speaking with the locals, but in this particular operation, any kind of communication with outsiders is strictly forbidden. Do not even tell them the name of your on your dog tags, is that clear? You should also note that it is currently summer in the Northern Hemisphere. Those of you who have already been deployed at least once will appreciate the fact that summers in Kaliningrad range from 55 degrees Fahrenheit to 73 degrees Fahrenheit, but it still rains just as often as any other season. You will be representing the Polish army. A zero tolerance policy towards misconduct will be in order. Is that clear? On this mission, you will be working alongside members of our elite force, the Raven Squad. Both Sergeant Coy and Sergeant Brana should be accompanied us during Operation Pologa, Pergolia. But fortunately, Sergeant Coy suffered an unexpected injury. Because of this impressive development, skills and qualifications, it was decided that Prophet Rook would be his replacement on the field. Private Rook. Yes, sir. You can find the briefing with the rest of your notes. Thank you, sir. If you have any doubts, ask someone in your squad. Okay, that's all from me. We'll count on you, soldiers. You're just missed. Information about the Corps and Operation Pergolda have been added to Rook's notes. You can access the notes tab from the menu. Okay, so we have all this stuff. We have items. So we have different things we can carry. Skills. Equip. A party. Notes. Quest. And we have settings here. Okay, let's do this. Can we talk to people? You're the new guy, right? It would be my first time outside, too. Now I finally know what all the fuss is about. You should go to the train room and warm up your aim one last time before deployment. Ravens are used as saving points. Interact with them to save your progress. Save your progress? Sure. Save it here. Okay. Hello. You can't help but admire our father, Junior Eugene. That must be the father over there on the left side. What's this? This is a training boom. Okay. Uh, hello. Even though I come here to train every day, I'm never going to be good enough to join the Raven Squad. I don't even have the courage to talk to them when they're around. Okay, what's this? Concussion grenade, one. One of them, added to your inventory. Okay. If you need any fixed, I'm your man. I can fix, upgrade, pretty much anything that we have here at the core. Okay. Okay, let's try it. We're going to, we're going to do this. Start training? Yes. Shooting at certain parts may paralyze the enemy making them unable to act for one turn. Try shooting at your target's arms to paralyze them. Attack. This guy. Arms. 
Chinny dummy has infected with Paris. Chinny dummy is paralyzed. While attacks miss their target, skills will never fail. Use it to your advantage. To your skills, you need skill points. If you ever run low of skill, of skill points, those items that will help you recover so that you can be ready for the next fight. Skill. You on this one? Chain dummy is paralyzed. You can also use items to damage your opponents, but once used, it'll be removed from your inventory. Okay, I am. So I found concussion grenade. So, just this one. On both of them, it looks like. Okay. Now finish your training battle using every tool in your arsenal. This guy has only one health, so we'll just attack him. There we go. Okay. Yeah. I think I might be ready for tomorrow. Information about the body targeting system has been added to Luke's notes. Okay. Excuse me. With the leadership of General Eugene Wisner, the Corps has become the biggest army in the world, giving us his children the responsibility to protect it from the enemies of peace. Private Rook, a moment, please. Yes, sir. I just want to take the time to congratulate you on your first deployment. Oh, thank you, sir. I'm pretty excited about this opportunity. That's good to hear. A high morale can give you an extra advantage in the battlefield. So make sure you keep those good spirits. Will do, sir. During your mission, you will increase morale by helping both your company as well as civilians that you meet on the surface. By increasing your morale, you will have better ways to deal with the hardships of combat. I suggest you go to the chain room and warm up your aim before deployment tomorrow. It'll do you good. Well, Private, good luck out there. Thank you, sir. Information about Morel has been added to Rook's notes. 7-4, Command Headquarters. So there's no way we are ready to look at your Morel, from what I gather. You just have to hope you're doing good with Morel. Okay. Hmm, what should I get? Power bar. I don't want to buy anything else. If you're going to away tomorrow, grab some to eat from that vending machine. You know, for the road. Thank you. Let's go in the chow hall, it looks like. Um, let's talk to this person. I can I talk to this person? I can't. Okay. Can I talk to this person? You are leaving tomorrow, right? Take this. Protein shake. I was saving that one for me, but you can have it. Is this your first time going outside? No. I don't think so. Hey! I found this cracked card while I was cleaning the, on cleaning duty. But to be honest, I don't really know what to do with it. It seems valuable, but it doesn't seem to work. In any case, I can't just throw it away, so I'll leave it in your hands. Cracked card. Um, what's a cracked card? In items... An old and cracked digital card. It should could be repaired. it could be repaired by a handyman. Okay. Can I open stuff? The kitchen is closed, no use to pick up a tray. 
Okay. The mountains of dirty dishes. I pity the poor guys on the mess today. No use to pick up a tray. Looks like they're cleaning up there. What's this? Okay. I ate too much. I think I'm going to bath, but I also want to keep eating. What am I going to do? So how did that would how did it go the other day at the research lab? I hear they're working on new crowd control guns or something. I can't believe they asked you to help while they tested it. Well, they basically made us form a line, and then they electrocuted us one by one to test the strength of their new stun gun prototype. Man, you're so lucky. Okay. I think we're good. Let me go back to this place over... Let me go in here for a second. And then... Go to this person. Hey, that's an old elevator card. Where did you find it? It seems broken, but I think I might be able to fix it for you. Okay, if you need anything fixed, I'm your man, I can fix, okay. Thank you for fixing that. Okay. Let's go up here. I can't go back there, okay. Let's get on the elevator. Use the elevator card to knock the bomb for. Alright, let's go to the barracks. Before we go to the bomb floor. I want to take a quick shower and then go to bed. <clears throat> Tomorrow's going to be a big day. A fire extinguisher. I'm not sure I know how to use one. Okay, fifth floor barracks. Let me tell you, the thing I'll miss the most while deployed is the calm and safety of our base. Maybe you should take this. It will be useful once you are up there in the surface. Detective Gel. Once you get to the surface, you feel like a new man. You'll never be the same. You won't buy anything. Make sure you come back in one piece. We'll do. Save your progress. Yes. Progress has been saved. Hey, Luke. Could you bring me back something from the surface when you come back? Anything is fine. Sure. Smoke grenades, the blind and enemy, enemy temporary. Smoke grenade times one added to your inventory. Okay. Let's go. What's this? Looks like. Are we going here? Do you think I might miss these hot showers? I might must be going crazy. Oh, this is a shower room. Okay. A moment, I'm doing one thing real quick. Uh, my volume's so good. Okay. Um, okay. Where am I? Hmm. That's my squad's medic. He should be able to give me some info about this operation. Uh, I believe his name is Adar. Maybe I should just call him Medic or something. Hey Adar. Adar. Have we met? Not really. I was just transferred this way to the force squad. So I was wonder. Oh! You're Sergeant Corey's replacement. You haven't been deployed before, have you? No. It's going to be my first time tomorrow, but I'm per- You seem way too calm. Well, I've been waiting for this day for years. I have never ever even seen the sun before. Try not to stare at it too much unless you want to go blind. Huh? You don't know anything about the surface, do you? I wouldn't get my hopes up if I were you. The surface, uh, surface is an awful place. Hmm. 
would you line up a little? This is not the time to relax. Well, what a obnoxious little prick. You're the guy who's filling in for Koi, right? Y yes, ma'am. I'm Luke, the Vimmer's company's first platoon. It's an honor. Yeah, whatever. I'm Sergeant Barana. If I wasn't com if it wasn't because Koi decided to be a jackass and break his arm, you wouldn't be here. Remember that. I know you won't be able to replace him, but at least try not to mess things up, okay? I'll do my best. I won't, ma'am. I'll do my best. That's why I'm afraid of Sorter. Because your best isn't enough to replace a member of the Raven Squad. Well, I'll see you tomorrow. Try not to get injured before we leave, so we can go and fight some bad guys, alright? Okay. You have a good day, ma'am. Um, can I talk to you? Would you give me some stuff? Every time we about my son and stuff signing that up. Nope. Enjoy your bed for the very last time. You'll be giving up the confidence of the core once you reach the surface. I should clean the dust off this thing, but not now. It has like some like fallout vibes. Like you're living in the bunker and now you have to go out and embrace the world for the first time. Oh, I should probably read this one again. The Perfect Shot 3. Breathing Techniques by Sergeant Coy. If I'm going to be developed, deployed in this place, I might as well steady his approach. You? Official Deployment Orders. The Course Order. 716 Rook. This is in order to inform you that you have been assigned to participate in Operation Pelogria. You must report to the briefing room at 1900 hours. What am I going to do with all these boxes? I guess I'll clean them once I'm back in the mission. I should probably wash this bag. My first foreign uniform. I wonder if it's been worn by someone else before. Should I go to bed? Yes. If there's anything I'll miss, it's probably this bed. I couldn't sleep at all last night, but at least I'm ready to leave early. I'll... Uh, I'll have to time to rest on the train, I guess. The train is on the first floor, so I better get going. Maybe I'll be the maybe I'll impress the, the Tinic type by being the first one there. Huh? I don't remember having this in my pocket. I feel like you're not gonna be the first one there. I feel like there's gonna be a whole bunch of people. <laughs> Let's go. Last time I arrived late, the sergeant shooting me out. Trust me, you don't want that. Another day, another mission. <laughs> Crap, everyone's here already. Hey you, move and get in line, quick. Attention short soldiers. Some of you may already know this, but our very own father, General Eugene Wisner, is going to be modern Operation Peloga. Father General will be giving you some words of encouragement now. It's him. Father General Eugene. The rumors are true. Father will be watching over us. I said quiet, soldiers. Please, Father General. The floor is yours. Thank you, Lieutenant Gilliff. Children of the Corps, the pleasure to speak to the most promising soldiers of this generation. If you are here today, it is because you have worked hard 
and you should be proud of yourselves. And you know, well, we the Co Army of the Corps have been given the privilege to be the protectors of humanity and aid and ally, ally to those who need it most. The mission for you to, uh, the mission you are about to take part of will become our biggest and most important operation in the history of the Corps. We'll be helping a dear nation of ours to fight against the evils threatening their freedom. You will be changing history. I expect you all to give you your best. There is no room for failure on this mission. The fate of a nation, and potentially the fate of the world, is in your hands. I trust that you, my dear children, by your skill and valor, will bring harmony to the world. There you have it, soldiers. Make Father General proud. Let's get moving, soldiers. All aboard the train. Day 2. Intercontinental platform inside the core. More than 15 hours have passed already. For the first time, I'm sitting on the train that connects me to the surface. This thing has been shaking the whole time, and it makes an ominous noise that won't let me sleep. Everyone looks wiped out, to say at least. To be honest, I'm not feeling too well either. I haven't eaten anything during the whole ride. I guess that's because they expect us to fall asleep. I'm already in a cranky mood, and to make things worse, I'm sitting right next to this guy. Hey. You should try to get some sleep. You know what? I'm too tired to pretend to be polite. Screw this guy. Didn't you say this was the time to relax? Ha 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 ha. What? Are you still mad about the thing I told you yesterday? You know, right now, I don't really want to. No, no. It's okay. I appreciate your honesty. Is that sarcasm or what? It's nothing like that. People are always kissing my ass. As if I would take care of them if they would piss me off. Well, let me save you the trouble. I'm a professional. I don't mix feelings with my job. Being my friend doesn't mean that I'll take care of you first. So tell me. Weren't you trying to do the same thing yesterday? I tried talking to you because I don't know anyone in the squad. I couldn't care less that you happen to be our medic. Is that so? Well, I'm glad you're not cynical like the others. Man, I've got news for you. Um, if you're still willing to listen to me, there are a couple of things I could tell you about the surface, since you were transferred so quickly, so suddenly. I'm guessing you haven't been properly, I'm guessing you haven't been properly introduced. I just got the briefing yesterday, so take a guess. Really? Well, you seem so curious about the sun that I thought I should warn you a little. To be honest, I really don't know if the sun could leave you blind. But what I do know is that it burns. It burns like pouring alcohol on an open wound. It can even toast your skin. It's quite fascinating. Why is this guy still talking? It's been like five minutes already. So yeah, based on that, I won't even try to look at it much. It sounds to me that the surface was awfully designed. Well, it certainly wasn't designed for us. But what was that? Did we finally arrive or... Uh, even the lights went out. We have arrived. Everyone get ready. We are opening the hatch. A 
soon as the door as soon as the door that separated us from the outside world opened, a strong and musty odor filled my lungs. With all this humidity, it feels as if a vacuum has sucked out the remaining air inside my uniform. There's no longer a roof above my head, and no walls surrounding me. It's both intriguing and weirdly unsettling. With trees as tall as the eye can see, selfishly breaking through the soil while competing with each other. I've been in simulations before, but the real thing is frankly a bit overwhelming. I really hope I, it gets better than this. Hey Wookie, don't stay behind. Save your progress? Yes. Your progress has been saved. Can I go back down? Nope. Okay. Soldiers, gather here. We'll be spraying up from here. Maceo, Bennett, Adair, Theon, go to your positions near the enemy base. Yes, sir. Engineers need to go to the northern point. Wait for the signal to cut their power supply. Yes, sir. That's where you come in, sniper. You'll handle the targets outside the range, the ones that are only visible from the hills. Shoot on sight. Don't let anyone escape. And you finish them off. When you finish them off, join the rest of the team. Understood? Yes, sir. Sergeant Branna will be assisting you. She will be your sparrer. Go to your position. Yes, sir. Okay, this is it. I have to learn, leave a very good impression to make sure they consider me for future missions. I just have to remember my chain and everything will be fine. I can do the Rook, can you hear me? Yes, ma'am, loud and clear. Can you see the enemy base from there? Yes, I see a couple of buildings up ahead. Okay, listen. The signal jammer has been deployed, and we are now about to cut off the power supply. After the power has been cut, that would be your chance to attack. Go over to the destroyed building to your left, and use it as your sniping point. On my way. I got some apples. Ooh. This will probably be good for food. Um... This one. Rook, are you ready? Rook, you should be able to reach four targets from where you're standing. Get ready. You have limited ammo? Yes, ma'am. Okay. Where's the last one? There he is. The area is clear. Now get down from where you are. You should be able to get a better view from the base from the small warehouse to your right. On my way. Rook, are you ready? Yes, I am. Okay. Um. One down. One down. 
Okay, where's the last one? Here he is. There we go. All clear. Stay alert and stand by while the rest of the squad enters the enemy base. Wait for further instructions. Hmm. Well, I always have to stay behind. And who watches my back anyway? Rook, go to the meeting point. Yes, ma'am. Save your progress? Yes. Okay, let's go this way. Don't worry, we're taking care of this area. Go north, rookie. Leave this part to us. Go north, rookie. Leave this part to us. Okay. I want Is everyone here? I want you all to explore every building and every alley. Any target kept alive is the threat to the operation. Go, go, go. I don't like this man. It's like he wants to kill everybody. Go north, Wookie. Check every corner. Enemies could be anywhere. Stay alert. Hey, we can't enter it until Captain gives us the heads up. I'm covering for a friend who's supposed to register this house, but she hasn't shown up yet. I can look around for her. Of course not. Isn't this your first mission anyway? Keep your nose out. I'm just trying to help, okay? I'll see if I can find her. Alright, do what you want, Loki. Just don't get me in trouble. Okay. This bedroom is empty, but you might never know if you can have some sort of secret bunker. Well, I don't know. I was told to keep an eye out. Secret bunker, huh? I'm starving and I ate all my rations. Rations, can I? You still have yours? Sure. I have one of them. Oh, it's apple cinnamon. One. I, uh, I'm not that hungry. I mean, okay. It's locked. Apparently, this is where the enemy stores store their good surprise. But the captain won't let us inside. Good old timing. We had to uh, mix up when we issued some of the kits, and some stores were lacking their first aid packs. Dell should be helping me out, but I haven't seen him around. I'm a bit busy right now. So, can you do me a favor and give these bandages to the rest of the squad? Sure. Okay. When you're done, come back here and report back to me. Sure. Um... Thanks, Wookie. I'll be honest with you. I haven't even noticed it was missing. Ha ha ha. Geez, I should be checking inside buildings, not guarding the spot. I told a friend of mine to cover for me, but when the tenant saw me outside of my spot, he told me to stay here instead. Oh, I know. You're new, right? Maybe you could go in my place. You might even get a badge if you find something interesting. Think about it. Go north, rookie. Leave this part to us. Okay, can I go in here now? I just spoke to your friend. She was assigned to another spot. Is that true? That dummy. I had to stand here for nothing. You can go ahead now. It's all yours.
Two pairs of shoes. I really hope this is an ambush. Hmm. Oh. I thought I could read it until I saw one of those weird backward letters. So this doesn't seem like there's anything in here. Just this phone with the Russian text or something. Assault. Okay. I suppose we continue up. There's like something over here. An enemy? Crap, he's fast. Save your progress? Yes. Hey, what's up, Fang Fango Bango? Good to see you. Your progress has been saved. Ooh, I got some berries. A lot of trash rounds around. What's this? Nothing. Okay. Um, is there a way to get in this way? No. Let's just go up. Barn Amini and it's his own base. This is such an obvious trap. I can't see a thing honestly. It's too dark in here. I have some bandages. Oh, thanks. I thought they had forgotten about me. There's no one inside. We already took care of it. I mean, okay. But I won't go inside and look. The road ends up ahead. I don't think there's any place left to check. I knew I was missing something. Thanks a lot. Alright, before we go up to see that guy. Because there is a guy there. Go down here. This person, I think it was this person. No, not you. We will talk to you. Okay. Hey, Fango. Thanks for following and... Foggy too. Thanks for the followers, guys. Um, let's see. Is it you? No. Gave me the bandages. You guy? Good job. I'll make sure to tell Lieutenant Gareth about your commitment to the mission. Hey, here's the spill kit for all your trouble. Don't tell the others I gave you an extra one, though. Okay. Let's go see what this person is up here now. Okay. He already wants to get away from me. The doors are locked, but it seems to be empty. He... He ran into a wall. This is especially easy. Am I going to get ambushed or something? Wait. What is this? The... This is definitely a kid. There's no way he'd be armed. Just what am I supposed to do here? Should I try and talk to him? Hey, it's okay. You can go now. That's sad. 
What are you waiting for, Private? Sir? I... I'm sorry, but he didn't seem to be a threat to the operation. I order you to elim eliminate any enemy on sight. Don't you ever question your chain of command again, you damn boot. Sir? I assure you it won't happen again. I'll let you off the hook this time. Go report this to your captain. Y yes, sir. I don't get it. What just happened? Go report to your captain now. Have you seen the captain? He's right in front of the brook house over there. Are you alright? No. Will I get court marshaled on my first mission? Yeah. Captain Edward? Private work. Requesting a permission to report? Permission granted. Captain, as of 41523 4 this morning, their area has been secured. There have been no casualties in our unit. 8. 8 enemy targets have been shot down from... Go on. They've been shot from 1st and 2nd sniping shots. And... And... Private? Uh, I'm... I'm sorry. I... I just need a moment. Sir, Private, you don't need to do a report right now, but, but, the situation is under control. Hmm. Medic. Someone give me a medic now. Rook has lost morale. Where am I? There's so much light. It hurts my eyes. Yeah, I love indie games. It's indie games are fun. Like, like you don't know what to expect. I've been playing a lot of indie games for my YouTube channel. I just don't really stream them too much. But I'm trying to get into the habit of streaming smart games. Are you feeling better? Where am I? Um, I guess you could call this a temporary aid station. You were car carried here after you fainted. But don't worry. It probably happened because you haven't slept or eaten anything. Anyway, the area is clear now, so you can sleep a bit longer if you need to. You still look quite pale, though. I'll get you some water. When it comes to games, though, I play anything very. Anything that looks fun and interesting. But lately, I've been playing indie games, like horror games, stuff like that. But I hope to play more like a wide, different kind of like a wide variety of games. But I don't know. Oh, very cool, very cool. Hopefully you do good, because I know those game jams can be quite, have quite a lot of submissions to them too. Hey. Thanks. It's okay. To be honest, nobody's gotten injured yet, so I haven't gotten, I haven't got much to do here. I mean, not that I want someone to get injured or anything. If you send me your game link, I'll make sure to check it out. Maybe I'll give it a try if it's, if you want. That guy is so weird. Sorry, tap auto tastes funny, so I got you one of these from the store. This guy went all the way to the store for me? By the way, do you remember anything before you passed out? Yeah, I remember clearly. I don't mean to pressure you, but I was told you almost let one of the targets escape. Um, how do I put this kindly? Whatever. It could have cost us the mission, you know? What happened back there? 
I couldn't do it. He was a civilian, a kid. He wasn't going to attack me or anyone else, so I didn't know if I had to shoot him at all. But why did you make an exception, exception for this target? Shooting any soldiers is a different story. Um. Okay, I'll check out that game um, later on or so. Shooting enemy soldiers is a different story. That's what I've been trained to do all my life. But can a civilian for no reason? Wait a minute. What? I'm... I'm surprised you have come this far and that you haven't figured out what kind of operation we are into. I thought you would have realized that by the time the targets went flying back. What do you mean? Wait, are you saying that all my targets were civilians? Are we the, at the wrong location? What the hell is going on? Is this guy messing with me? But I don't get it. Why would Poland do this then? How could they possibly benefit from killing civilians? Besides, for such a dirty job, why call for our help? Why would they need the court to be here? using their uniforms and everything. Have you seen a real Polish soldier around? There's no war going on in Kaliningrad. Eh? And we were sent here to change that. This makes no sense. I, I can't even process all this stuff right now. What about the briefing? That's the statement we were supposed to give out if any of us were captured. I take it I'm the only one who wasn't aware of this, right? They might have decided it wasn't they might have decided it was better to not to tell you. What what in the hell are we? Are we some kind of terrorists? It's called a false false flag operation. How's that any different from terrorism? And how can you be so calm knowing that? I'm afraid that's all I know. What am I supposed to do now? Just follow the orders. Don't question them. I... I can't do this. I just can't keep doing something like this until the day I die. It's going to drive me insane. Then what's your plan? I... I don't know that. But I do know this. I, but I do know this is what I don't want to do. Anything but this. If I could, I'd just get the hell away. Even if that means getting executed. Seriously, you need to calm down a little. You aren't thinking clearly. This dog tag. Even the name on it has nothing to do with me. Would they actually know if... No, it used to be mine if I died? Here, I'll save you the hassle of picking it up there. Stop this nonsense. There are other ways you can deal with this. Like what? If there was another situation, I'd have I'd have taken it already. Save your progress? Yes. Oh, this game is getting deep too. <laughs> Looks like nothing's missing from my bag. Can't look at that picture. I want to look at that picture, but it's like, well, not there me. Okay. Get my gun. I never thought I'd say this, but this rifle is the last thing I want to see right now. Makes sense. But this is... What if this room belongs to one of my targets? I... I don't want to think about it. What's this? Oh, okay. I'm sorry, man. You know, as a medic, I have a mission to take wounded soldiers into other facilities by myself. And I could fail the paperwork reporting a somewhat serious condition. A condition that can grant you a convalescent leave. 
but that cannot be spotted with the naked eye. Is there such a thing? Of course there is, but... Hmm. What? I'll say is tintitis. What the hell is that? It's a symptom that is so uncommon with soldiers, especially if they are not wearing ear protection. It makes you hear an annoying and repetitive sound that no one else can perceive. You can get to leave just for that? It's actually a pretty big deal. Some people have to live with that forever. So I can take you to the hospital, and you'll stay there until the mission is over. It should give you enough time to cool your head off. Okay. I guess it's better than nothing. Alright. I'll fill the report. I can't guarantee it will work, though. It doesn't matter. Just do it. Please. Okay. When I'm finished, we'll meet outside. It won't take too long. Even if I go now, I'll have to come back eventually. Father Farming orders and doing this kind of thing again. I wonder if there's a chance I could escape on my way to the hospital. Sir, there's been an update on Private Rook's condition. What is it? I'm afraid the symptoms suggest he might be suffering from tinnitus. Since we don't have the necessary tools here, I'll need you to take him to the field hospital. What is with our snipers lately? First Sergeant Coy, and now his replacement? I have a name, you know. Hand me the paperwork. Hmm. How long will this take? Three or four hours should be enough, I think. I'll be back before it gets dark. We need to make sure this tin time Tin it tires isn't nothing isn't something serious. We can't afford to lose another sniper. Hey Wookie, did you forget to wear air protection? Uh right. I'm supposed to play along. I can't screw this up. Uh Captain, his ears seem to be heavy clogged too. I need to run an autometric test. But we don't have, even have an autoscope here. Really? Those pricks from the foot squad always get all the resources. Hmm. Oh, Adair? When you get to the other facility, ask them to spare us some coffee. We're running short. Sure thing. We'll do. That was surprisingly easy. Okay, we need to leave for the southern exit. Adair has joined the party. Uh, okay, can't go back in. It's locked. So we have to go south, it says. It's locked. I'm actually exploring right now before I go south. <laughs> so there was a dead body there. It's like we're still in the enemy's camp. What are you doing? I told you to go south. Okay, we have to go south. To the south we go. To save my game. Uh, now we can get this. Core. We can get some soda. Can we go in here? Start. Um, this way. Okay. Okay. Uh, I just can't keep doing something like this until the day I die. It's going to drive me insane. If I could, I'd just get the hell away. Even if it means getting executed. So wait, we're being watched. Someone's actually listening to our conversation. Um, hey. Yes. 
So, what are we doing exactly? I thought I told you the plan already. You'll stay in the field hospital until the mission's over. That's it? Well, yeah. What did you expect? I don't know, Ray. It's just... I don't want to. I just can't keep doing this. I'm... I'm sorry. I... Please just get me out of here. But... I'm already risking a lot by taking you to the hospital. I swear, if you try to run away while I'm in charge of you... Listen, what you need right now is to rest and clear your head. If Father General sent us here, it's because we we're meant to do this. I guess you want us to keep going. Uh, so many backward letters. And it's got an exclamination point, too. Come on, give me the soda. I see a soda here. I guess I can't take the soda. Oh, well. <laughs> um, I go this way. What? Why is it blocked? Maybe there's a way around it? I mean, obviously, yeah. But that would take too long. I told the captain I'll be back in three or four hours. If I recall correctly, there was another route just a mile away. But it's a bit close to mission perimeter. We'll have to, we'll, we'll have to head east, so don't wander around. You hear me? I won't. Okay. Can I go in the mantle? Nope. Okay. Let's go around to the east. Which is probably this direction. Which looks like it's broken. Save your progress. Yes. Is it numerous slots? No. Okay. Let's save the game here. Progress has been saved. Danger. Oh, find a sign with an English tr translation. It's not very useful though. Oh, come on. This is getting annoying. We'll never get to the hospital at this rate. No, no, no. There's gotta be a way. I promise. Trust me. Look, I don't want to waste more time with this. I'm not going to jump over a bridge, climb a mountain, or swim across a river just so you can have your vacation. I need to be back with the squad if someone needs me. We are already here. Just let me look around. I'm sure there's a way to cross that bridge. Ugh, fine. You have 10 minutes. I got a Belladonna. That's a Belladonna. Look what I found. We might be able to cross the river of this. Oh wow, a prank. That thing will break in half the minute, minute you step on it. Just look at it. Hey, I know what I'm doing. We had a similar drill once, and I was the first one to come up with a solution. I mean, it was a simulation, but it was pretty realistic. Maybe we weren't actually trying to cross the river. 
And now that I remember, it wasn't part of the assignment. Not that it matters. I got this. Sigh. Wooden plank added to inventory. Okay, let's go back up. Go over here now. Let's see how this works. Hey, it worked. Wait, hold on. Do you hear that? Huh? What, the river? No, no, it's something I have heard before. Like a buzz. Must be some kind of insect. Crap. It's one of our drones. Quick. Hide. Why are we hiding? If that thing sees us, we're done. We're very close to the edge of the perimeter. I knew this was a bad idea. Let's try to find another way. Wait, don't. Shit, it's coming toward us. Wait, don't shoot. Soldier 716, Rook. Soldier 802, Adair. Found outside mission area. Why? We're not doing anything wrong. We've got permission to be here. We can't reason with this thing. We'll have to take it down if we want to survive. Yes, I guess you're right. Well, well, up. Okay, let's uh attack it. Um I want to heal, I want to attack. So, attack, middle. Attack the... There we go. I got some loot. Uh, let's do... I think we have enough food on us. Let's do this one. I'm going back. I can't take you to the hospital now. I'm sorry, but I'm not risking my life for this. But what? No, I just can't. You better come with me if you value yours. Let's go. Quick, before someone else notices we're here. I told you already, we're going back. Take your progress, yes. Uh oh. Oh, we should go talk to them, explain what's happening. Maybe if I show them the paperwork, they... So who were they? 716 and... 716A or 2. They go by Wook and Adair. Oh, Adair. That's one of the Megs, right? 
What a shame. I've never heard of this other guy though. What is he? A traitor. Both of them. Their jobs don't really matter if they won't follow basic instructions. I guess you're right. Remember, shoe on sight. What? What? What's going on? Why are they looking for us? They called us traitors. There's got to be a misunderstanding. We have to tell them. They also said shoe on sight. Listen, I've got a good reputation. They will hear me out. I hope. Adir, we have to run. But... Quick, just come with me. But wait. Come on, we're going, we're going to go away from them. We're going here. I can hide in that, it looks like. Okay. There's a sign. That sign should tell us where we are, right? Yeah, that's very helpful. <laughs> oh, I can push stuff. Okay, push it down. There we go. Chocolate bar. I could run, but good to know. Uh oh, another drone. Two drones. Attack. This one. It's not good. Uh, let me actually. What, what items do I have? Oh, wait, I have this stuff. Uh, this. I forgot I had grenades. What do you have? Oh, okay. It's shows the stuff. Okay, let's do the smoke grenade. On this one. Okay, help he doesn't die. Okay, attack. This one. A body. Attack. This one. Main body. Okay. Attack. Main body. Attack. Main body. Okay. Attack. Main body. Oh no, just... 1% health. Okay, you want to do that? Alright, dead. Combat drone has been defeated. We need to recover health. I don't get it. The granted us permission to go to the hospital. I shouldn't have helped you in the first place. And if I was stupid enough to believe what you said on the chain? That you wouldn't take advantage of being a medic? 
What the hell am I going to do now? I'm sorry I got you involved. Yeah, of course you're going to say that. You decided to run away because you didn't want to fight against some people you don't even know. And look where you got us. Our own brothers are hunting us down. But hey, at least you're sorry. Let's go before they get to us. We've, I've got to figure out a way to fix this. Okay, so we're at... Let's go to my items. Hearing. We're going to do this. For you. 60, so one more time. And then for myself. Like so. Okay. We should be good now. Okay. Hopefully that's good for now. We should probably find a bird to save our game. Go up here. Where does this go? Oh, it was like a... What is this? It's one of our camps. It seems to be abandoned though. And they just have all this stuff here? That's the weird part. It doesn't look like it's been for a while. I wonder if they're planning to come back soon. I say we just take stuff out before they come back. This is your mistake. Let's see if I can adjust the finger seat. But that's all I could hear from where I was standing. Okay, it works. Shh. I can't listen if you keep talking. Man, that's... Wow. What does that even mean? Well, I'm just as puzzled as you are. Do you think she might be alive? I don't know. Chances are looking grim. Crap. I really looked up to Raven's Fae. Yeah. Out of all the ravens, Sergeant Faye was the one who, the one without her head up her ass. I, really, I have really had it with this superiority complex. Yeah, screw those pricks. Shit, look at all the time I have to go back to the base, or they're going to kick my ass again. Talk to you later. Ha ha ha. Did they have to all alone on patrol again? Hello? Oh, okay. Hmm. Looks like the transmission ended. I wonder what was the thing about Sergeant. I wonder what was that thing about Sergeant Faye. I had heard the news, but hey, buddy, I know what would cheer you up. You know where the abandoned hut is, right? I left a couple of treats. Just use code zero seven seven three four zero seven seven three four. And you can take them. End of transmission. Should we look for it? Let's go. Treats in the woods. That sounds like a good song name. Treats in the woods. <laughs> can we go in here and take some stuff? Mysterious shot. There's nothing here. There's nothing here. This bonfire hasn't been here for long. Maybe it's not abandoned at all. Let's finish this in this area quickly. Okay. I wonder, can I go this way? Or... Mm. No, I can't. I have to go down. Going this way. There's that thing over there. Oh, there's one thing right here, too. Concussion grenade, which is good to have. Oh, there's two of them. We hit the gold mine. Ooh, there's some bread. And some cola. Good to know. Let's go up.
Okay, grab this. Sweet cookies. There's a lot of food around. That's good to know. So I think this abandoned hut is where we um build the first drone. It can only make sense when we run. Go down here. So we haven't gone that way. Let me go down this way first for a minute. Go up here. Let's go up here. This way. This hut. Right. There's a loose board here. Should I move it? Move it. Hey, I found a keypad here. Don't you dare enter some random numbers into it. We don't know what it's for. Input code. We type down 0773. This one. Oh, it worked. And there's something inside. Got some berries. A cola. Chocolate bar. Bread. It wasn't that bad. Let's go. Go right down here, this way, this way, up here. Okay, we go this way now. Since this new area, we'll just walk. Uh oh. If you get stuck, come talk to me. Sure. Okay, we do that. Push this one up. Open this. Get a shot. We don't have to go that way. Um, go this way, I suppose. No, that can't be right. Okay. You said come talk to you? Okay. Yes, push back to the original positions. Okay. So... So we go up here. Okay, can I get around this? No. So... Wait, there's no way to get there, though. Is there? Yes, go back to normal, the uh, regular position. Let me see something. So, can I go around here? No. So, let's we'll see. So, let's push this one up here. Go this way. Oh, wait. Let me try something. Um. Push that one that way. Push that one that way. Push. Okay, that works. Now we can save the game. Okay, progress. Yes. Okay. Progress has been saved. Let's continue down the pathway. Uh oh. Hey. They are. Here they are. You two will finally face your punishment. Wait. Don't shoot. We have no intention to fight. We can explain what's going on. Here. I was granted permission to take this soldier back to the. Private 716. Your service ends here. The Corps has no place for defective soldiers. Defective? What are you talking about? What do you mean, defective? This is a misunderstanding. He's not de defective. This is just temporary. 
failure to follow instructions, question your super question your superiors, and on top of that, desertion desert and complicity. What? Your little, con your little conversation's been recorded, Doc. We... We swore to protect everyone, to make the world a better place. We've been told all our lives that we are the protectors. That's what people expect from us. I may have failed to follow my orders, but I don't regret it at all. <clears throat> Maybe I'm an idiot because I still don't understand what we were trying to accomplish with this mission. But I do know that shooting superiors is not what I meant to do. None of us should be doing this. It's even worse than I thought. He's delusional. Private. Not only are you betraying your brothers, you are also insulting Father General Eugene. I'm not going back if I have to kill innocent people. There are limits to what they can make me do. I'm not going back if it means I'll have to keep doing the same thing. Is that so? There's no train back now. And you, 802? You should be ashamed of yourself. The lieutenant had high hopes for you, and that you decide to do such a thing. No. Goodbye, brothers. I wonder if it's possible to kill these people. So this is the medic right here. The core medic. So we'll have to shoot, kill this medic. Attack. The medic. Okay. Attack. A medic. We should we hit the body. And then we're going to use an IM. We're going to use a smoke grenade. And uh, one with more health. Okay, he's been blinded. Okay, uh, skill, this one, this one. Um, what's, my, what's my skill? Heal, heal is a mod, no. Attack, this one. Okay, attack this guy attack him in the head. Okay. Attack you in the head. Okay. Attack you. Goodbye. You are not saving anyone by doing this. Our brothers will keep coming after you. This isn't over. Let. It'll be okay. They are just unconscious. But we can't stay here. 
to send more people looking for us. Let's go. Luke has learned warning shot and breathing technique. Adil has learned first aid. So, we need to heal. So, heal. Okay, we have full health, so we don't have to worry about that. Good to know. Okay, I'm going to try to get to a safe game spot, and then I'm probably going to call it a night. I have to wake up early in the morning, so yeah. Thank you for helping me back there. You don't have to thank me. I'm sorry, actually. The things you said, they are beginning to make sense now. I think I kind of know how you feel. feel. I never ever questioned anything. I'm so used to following orders that I never even asked myself if I was okay with them in the first place. But what you said is right. What's the point in fighting for a war we don't fully understand? Why does the Corps want to start this war? We don't know, and they are not telling us either. We are completely disposable. We just don't matter to them. What we say, what we think, not even our lives have any meaning back home. That's why we have no other option but to keep running. It's just the two, us, two of us now. Sir, I found them. Shit. More of them are coming. We have to jump. Are you crazy? A bow in the head hurts less than drowning. Just jump. Dark? Hey, Dark. Are you alive? Looks like we lost them. At least for now. Have you seen our weapons? Seems they got carried away. But at least we have my rifle. No way. What's wrong? The barrel got bent. We are completely screwed. Hmm. The things in my bag seem to be fine at least. Hey. That's a city, isn't it? Hmm. Should we ask for directions? We own these uniforms. That's probably a bad idea. Let's look around. Maybe we can find something to disguise ourselves. Would it be bad if we took these? If no one's wearing them, it means they'll have a spirit clothes. It means they have spirit clothes, right? And what should we do with our uniforms? Leave them behind that trash bin? Hopefully no one will find them there. I don't think I'll be able to run in these. Shut it. We just need to blend in. Let's enter the sea. We are too exposed here. Alright. I know I said we were going to call it quits, but let's do one more save. 
Save your progress. Yes. One more save. It's locked. I kind of want to explore the sea before we do anything else. <laughs> oh, it's a, it's a sea. What's going on? Let's follow them. Sir, askew. You dropped something. That wasn't there before. What? What's that? He looked incredibly upset. I wonder what's going on. Hmm. I think he might have dropped something. We should have handed it back to him. Should we go look for him? Rook, we don't have time for that. We need to find a way to get out of here quickly. Yeah, but... Well, it's a letter after all, so it should say where we could find him or where it should be sent to. I'll keep it with me. I am a little job by a man on his way out of town. Okay. I might not understand a word, but I can't, can tell she's upset. The big pile of luggage. I should leave it alone. I can't read what it says. It's locked. I wish I could understand what the other yeah, saying. Sweet cookies. It's no use. I don't know what to say to that. Everyone seems to be in a rush. Could it be they already know what's going on? I'm getting a little worried. We better keep following them. No, let me do this. Let me do this real quick. I'm gonna run this way. The guy went this way. Can I go into this guy's house now? It's locked. No. Making sure I can't go anywhere over here. Wait, there's the cat. Oh, look at this fuzzy, fluffy -er cat. Okay. There's a woman standing here. Oh, she talks Russian too. Okay. This is where we save the game. Save your progress? Yes. Okay. So, I'm gonna cut it here. I've been streaming for about two hours. I have to wake up early in the morning. So, if this is something you enjoy, let me know. I'll probably be streaming this again tomorrow evening, so stay tuned. Well, tomorrow, today, it's Sunday morning, so... I'll be streaming this later, so thank you to those who joined me today. If this is something you enjoyed, let me know, like I say. But thanks for watching everyone. See you guys soon. Take care. Bye-bye.